I said, we doing dinner in a movie. And this man I just met today, and his your name is? Gerard. Gerard. And Gerard uh, was, uh, neighbor, um, was a neighbor of the young man that was murdered by the Baltimore City Police here. We do dinner in a movie in different places and locations across Baltimore where police involved shootings where death resulted in a black man's life being lost. So, uh, can you tell us what you know about this young man? I basically grew up with my kids. Uh, known him practically all of his life. Uh, day of the killing, my youngest, four, he was, uh, I think, 14 at the time he was shot. And my youngest son came to me. I was in bed, and he asked if he could go ride bike that Saturday morning with his best friend, Kevin. When he goes down, and, and he's looking through Kevin's storm door, and he sees the um, police and Kevin have an exchange of words. And he saw the police officer when he shot Kevin. Uh, in his kitchen. This was a, a, a police involved shooting here and he lost a young man's life. We dying out here, man, and don't nobody seem to care. So my way of giving back to the community, because I contributed so much negativity in my past, is doing dinner in the movie. Anything positive in the community is what I do. You can't tie me to my past and you gotta unlock my past to get these young men a bright future. So when you see me, it ain't nothing but the good in the hood. And the night you're going to see this, dinner in the movie. Come on out. Bring something to eat. I got the chicken. Y'all bring the bread. Top of the 300 block of Farn Hill Avenue.